Welcome to Retro Tour. Today we're continuing our playthrough of Super Mario World on the Super Nintendo Classic Mini. We will search for the secrets of Chocolate Island, fight Wendy Koopa at Castle Number 6, and enter the Valley of Bowser. I might be going back for that warp pipe. I haven't decided yet, but let's let's finish up Chocolate Island the normal way first. So, okay. Hmm. Ah, Yosh. Let's see how long you last before I just hurl you off a cliff or something. I mean, I know that I don't want to use that P switch yet. Yeah, maybe for that. spit that thing out periodically if you're gonna have Yoshi carry it. Because if you don't, he's he'll swallow it. Oop. Hey. Uh did I wanna do <laughs> cheap cheeps? <laughs> nope. Don't want it. Ah! You can't force me to take the mushroom. How often a Mario Brothers player says that? Because if I pick it up, it'll replace my Fire Flower. I'd rather have a Fire Flower than a Mush. Alright, cool. Um, oh, okay. Having, f <laughs> having flashbacks to Tubular here. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Yoshi! <laughs> Is the reason that they call tubular tubular because there's those warp tubes in it? Is that is that what that's all about? I or is it well, I don't know. That's something that's gonna bother me now. I mean, is it just a weird coincidence? Am I just looking at it to it too much? Have I been scarred for life? Because of tubular? I don't know. Great mystery of the universe. You know, it just occurred to me I had a backup flower that whole time that I totally could have used. Okay, before I take on Wendy, let's let's check this place out. I know it'd be more helpful if I had a fire, if I had a cape, but yeah, I can get by on this. I hope. You know, even though it doesn't really use like any of the music from the previous Mario games, I really love the soundtrack in Mario World. It does. I don't think it gets used all that often in, like, later games. It's mainly the soundtrack from, the from, uh, you know, the first game. I guess, you know, the same can be said about, you know, Super Mario Bros. 2, because, I mean, soundtrack for that is barely used. But then again, I mean, does do Super Mario games reuse their soundtracks that much? I mean, you know, except for just send-ups? Oh. When I missed that jump, I should have started selecting out before I lost, you know, both my feathers. Yeah, I can't think of any. You know, I can't really think of any games that, you know, really reuse the soundtrack. I mean, like, except specifically as a reference to the Mario game that it's from. Like, I mean, you know, Super Mario 64 had a great soundtrack, too, but, you know, I can't remember any repeat songs in it, you know, from earlier Mario games. 
Oh, that was cool. But I mean, it's also been a long time since I played Mario 64. I remember trading my copy of Super Mario 64 to a friend for another game, but I don't remember what game it was. I don't... Yeah, I really don't remember. I seem to think it was a Game Boy Advance game, like, uh... Like Golden Sun or something? Yeah. I know they like the game way more than I did. Oh, well... <laughs> okay, I was right! That just sends me in a circle. So, let's see if I can get a different exit on this guy. So, I'm just going to pop... Oh, I collected one coin. Two coins. But I really wanted Yosh. So, I'm going to go through here. And... I'm going to see if just powering my way through here as fast as I can gets me a different... Goodbye, Yosh. <laughs> gets me a different resolution. I, it did. Okay, I was not expecting it, honestly. <laughs> I was totally expecting the mushroom place. A uh, key? Okay, wait. Was the other one the normal one and this is the secret? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's exactly what's going on. Wait, oh, okay, so this is the secret. Yeah, this is chocolate secret. Okay. So, it turns out I was totally wrong last episode. And... No, you're a tube. You're both tubular. Ooh. Those kind of charging checks will forever be checks I do not like. Because they remind me of tubular. I got scars. Scars that last forever. Oh my, what is this nonsense? Oh, oh, what the? Please stop. Please stop. Um, what's, what's going on here? That's, that's a beetle. Whee. Oh, <laughs> that would have hurt. Guys, what are those guys are even called? Spikies? I don't know. Definitely not spinies. Oh dear. Oh my goodness. I should be dead. I should totally be dead. I don't know why I'm not. So. Oh, <laughs> so. Oh my gosh, get out of here! If I wanted to take the charging checks out, I totally should have done with a cape. I can just flip it and that'll take care of it. Oh man. Oof. That's a... That was a neat level. And another one that, you know, kind of lets me see Bowser's castle there. So... 
Okay. So now we're at Wendy's Castle, and I think I've gotten everything that needs getting here. Cool. Here, I was thinking that I forgot something. Okay. Alright. Taking on Wendy. Let's see what her place is like. Oh, man, this place. Oh, you ever wonder where those things in Mario Maker came from? This is it. Things that are made, or er, that people who hate you use to make their levels. Now, speaking of which, I am totally stoked about Mario Maker 2 coming out. Kind of curious if they're going to, like, implement some more stuff. You know, that, like, in this game. I know that they're doing things like slopes, which... Oh, man, I got off so lucky. Because usually those things don't just get rid of a hit. They actually get rid of a hit, then kill you. Because they continue to crush you. I just got grazed by it. That's the only reason I am still alive. Is that blue block helpful? I, I seriously don't know. Alright, there we go. Now, this part is awful. Ow. Got it. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That was not nearly as bad as I remember it. Yeah, I'm glad that there was a checkpoint there. Now, the rest of this, if I remember correctly, is not too bad. Just, you know, these weird sparky dudes. And, you know, crushing. I see that, uh, you know, Wendy hired the same interior decorator as Morton. Same kind of thing. Just, you know, she decided to go with horizontal instead of vertical. Yeah, to each their own. Oh, boy. Oh, my... <laughs> I knew as soon as that was happening, I was dead. <sighs> okay. Let's not forget. There we go. In we go. And... Alright. Let's not make the same... Whoa! Let's not make the same silly mistake. Let's say let's make a whole new silly mistake. I mean, don't want to be redundant here. There we go. Now that thing is what killed me. Yeah, yep, there it is. And <laughs> I wanted the mushroom, so I flung myself into the chasm. And get neither the mushroom nor save my life. I'm not good at this. Uh, eh? Oops. Well, easy come, easy go, I suppose. See, that was a strategy. Now there's less wind resistance on me. Because, you know, my character's shorter now. Whoa! <laughs> Dancing on the edge there, Mario, and then just decided, nah, you know what? We, we, we can just jump off. It's cool. Man. So... I will temporarily impede my progress by, you know, gaining a bit of wind resistance. No, 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 nope, can't make it. I mean, I might have been able to make it, but... Oh, come on. Okay, now, yeah, now I'm back in the form I prefer. 
Small Mario. Yeah, that's it. Alright, so there it is. You know, I should just, you know, spin jump there, so even if I do land on it, I'm still safe. You know, it's... And, you know, the funny thing is I never actually died in the more difficult part of this dungeon. Those giant stomp... Or those giant, uh... Spiked pillar things? Is there a word for those? Crushers? I don't know. I'm sure there is. Everything in Mario is named. I'm sure these bricks here are named. That one's named Bob. Hello, Bob. So. Whoa, whoa, what just happened? Okay, there we go. And, thank heavens, a green block. It saves me again. Or does it? Ah, uh, here we are. Oh, darn it. See, this is what... Oh, boy. This is what usually happens when I fight Lemmy. The spot... Er... He comes out of the worst possible pipes. There we go. Okay. Instead, like, you know, Lemmy came up in the best pipe, like, three times. Oh, God! Now, Wendy actually... was a little bit... was a little bit coy about being in a place I could hit her. All right. Yep, you just washed it away. Wendy O. Koopa in the castle has sung her last song. Mario must meet the challenge that is now before him. There is a sunken ship that appears to be a gateway to the Valley of Bowser. So... For those of you that have played Mario Brothers 3, you might recognize the sunken ghost ship here. It's actually supposed to be the uh, one of the ghost ships from Super Mario Brothers 3 um, that the Koopa Kids um, used to terrorize the Mushroom Kingdom. Now, why on earth did it end up like going down here in Dinosaur Land? I have no idea. But, this level has pathways that you have to swim through. You can't touch the booze. You touch them, you get hit. Now, you'll notice that it's actually pretty generous about the hit detection. It gives you about a second or so after they fade in. They don't just, you know, cheap shot nail you. Which, I mean... I appreciate. Okay, now we're past the maze. Now we're at... Next part of it. I still remember this part not being too difficult. Of course, every time I say that, I die horribly over and over again. So, dang. Is that, is that it? Man, I remember that being harder. Whee! Um, I'm not hitting, like, anything on the way down here. Uh-oh. Ah! Oh, dear. Oh, dear! Ah, there we go. Now, you might remember those little blocks, that little question mark block was, again, from Super Mario Bros. 3. If I remember correctly, after you beat the fortress, you get one of those, and it unlocks a door. Well, here, 
it also unlocks the door to the Valley of Bowser. So here we are. The final stretch. We are ready to get to the Valley of Bowser. I don't think I'm going to get there the next episode. I'm not sure how, how long this is going to take for me to get through it, because some of the stuff in here is pretty hard. But... We're, uh, but we're here. We're in the last place. And we've gotten everything up to this point. If you liked the video, go ahead and hit the like and subscribe buttons. You know where they are. If you want to see other games I'm doing, go ahead and check them out here. Thanks for watching, everyone, and join us next time here on Retro Tour.